So we've got a, got a little friend today on the fencing game with us. Um, brought him along today. See how many, see how many posts he can get put in. Oh, let's see how good his fencing skills are. Morning, everybody. Another great week coming up. Monday morning. Up, we're all ready to rock and roll this week. It's actually a five-day week this week, which I haven't been for the last two weeks. And I believe it's a bank holiday coming up again the week after. So many bank holidays at the minute, but there you go. So what are we on with this week? Um, today, Monday, uh, my guys are over in Otley. This is a job that's been booked in for oof, probably four or five months now, but it's just been too wet to go and actually install it because it's literally about a mile down a track at the side of a river and in the winter months it's just too boggy to get the van anywhere near so literally this is the first chance we've had this week it's been dry couple of domestic jobs i think rest of the week actually if i'm not mistaken um i actually uh looked at the diary this morning i'll have to do but anyway we'll take you along for the ride and if you like what we do give us a thumbs up and we'll catch you later thank you good morning guys so we're over on a little domestic well little 35 meter uh, domestic job today and um, they're having 1.8 uh, feather edge fencing and uh, we've been here before it's actually uh, lads who used to work here it's actually their old dinner lady so oh yeah a bit of a surprise for them hopefully you know we, we get some dinner today you never know but uh, i'll show you what they're on with in the stun loaded up vans getting prepared now so see unloaded up vans i'm gonna get it posted and railed today what we're going to be doing is we're going to be replacing i know it's hard to see because the van's there this will probably be day two this bit but we're going to be replacing these panels here and the posts and then they actually asked for a gap there, but now they want it filling. Um, what's going to be a, a job we do another day now. And then um, coming around back, it's a very nice garden. I'll give them that. We actually, that the black, what's being painted now, we actually installed that. So we're actually going to be carrying on from there. We're going to be bringing it out just a little, just to miss these big concrete bricks in the floor. You know, as you can see, because if we don't, these bushes have been trimmed back that much that you trim it any, any further it's just going to look stupid so we'll come in front of there and then what we'll do is we'll dog leg it back in and then follow the line back down and push it up back's easy well easier um front's going to be a bit of a bit of a more tricky one and um, just because it's going into you know some nice stone I'm hoping that we might be able to slip the posts out of them holes and then uh, reset ours in there and uh, cement them up and concrete them up. Um, hopefully that does the truck. So we've got a, got a little friend today on the fencing game with us. Um, brought him along today, see how many see how many posts he can get put in and rails put in. He don't go too far. It's not every day you're putting up a fence in, you know. One of these pop out. Let's see how good his fencing skills are. So it's Friday, bank holiday weekend for some of us. And uh, lovely blue skies brilliant way to kick off uh, bank holiday weekend so we're just over in uh, Ilkley again today um, brought 
some gear over for the lads and uh, they got it all posted up yesterday so let's give you a quick tour of what they've done. We'll come just in front of that tree, just in front of it and we're going to overhang the rails at this side just so it covers the gap because it's a bit worried about the dog getting out so we'll do that. But yeah they've uh, got all the posts in yesterday obviously it's, it's fencing's all right when it's a uh, you know a nice beautiful day like this they actually did the neighbor's fence i'll show you that in a second and they said it were absolute torrential downpour when they were doing it <laughs> yeah so what what's happened here is the reason why we've cut back in is because where this curb just drops here there's actually a utility box underground just there so obviously we have to leave access for the utility box um, just in case they ever do anything or he says they haven't been out in years and years and years but you know you know people's luck they'll get a new fence put up and then uh, you know they'll be out next day to try to get into it to this post here and then back up and then all the way to where these two trees have been cut and then step back up again and then just underneath these beautiful high trees and then all the way to the end this is the fence that we actually did for his neighbor so he's, he's actually getting exactly the same so these are these are actually 100 by 22 pails so there's uh, let's put it this way there's some money in these fences you know, cost a pretty penny all that materials and i've got the nice 95 mil capping up on top as well with a little ridge just for when it rains so like i said this is this was done a couple of years ago this for his neighbor's fence but they said this you know that it won't they won't work in on a day like this you know look at beautiful blue sky out today uh, plan is get it all railed get it all paled get all capping on today and then um job's a good one they should uh should be done this afternoon for the uh, bank holiday celebrations. I wonder if anybody's going away. But yeah, um, I'm gonna crack on because uh, just, just before they end up getting here, I've just turned up a bit earlier just so I can get all the materials because there were that many materials that it took us two vans to get over. So I'm just gonna unload all this for them now and then um, I'm gonna nip off to, uh, I believe it's um, Great Autumn Primary School. Um, just a bit of a palisade that they need quoting for and um, we crank posts so get over there for about 11 o'clock and uh, get that quoted up for them but yeah guys if uh, we don't see you we will give you a finished video at the end of the day what be done by myself because like I said we're all the way over in Ilkley but yeah um, hope you have a good weekend and uh, don't drink too much feeling again lovely sunny day here in Bradford beautiful wish every day were like this another busy week here at Airedale been mainly domestics this week but uh, yeah we've been smashing them out lots of doing well finishing off a biggish sort of timber double paling job in Ilkley today we actually did the neighbours we've done a few bits for the neighbour at both ice home and commercial premises he has um, and then next week we've got a uh, school to do 
in uh, where is it Cullingworth yeah Parkside School should be a decent one that's about 150 meters I think it is and taking some old 1.2 mesh out as well so we'll get some good footage of that might even get the drone out next week weather's nice so anyway if you like what we do give us a thumbs up leave us a comment take it all easy and have a great weekend oh and it's bank holiday so we're actually back tuesday another short week